yesterday, December 7, 1941, a date which will live in infamy. The United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. everybody so we're back for the end of turn four in g40 enderman's uh house rule game so to start our turn america has 70 dollars uh we're gonna buy a destroyer two tanks three infantry three transports and two fighters for all 70 dollars even then from that, we are going to start with our combat movements. So, move this stuff back out of the way. So for combats, we are going to start on the east coast. We're gonna do two into Tunisia. So that's one off of Germany, one for America. Then we are going to do It's actually, uh, sorry, this is part of the combat because it's non go through my own territory into the second movement. Um, part of the attack. Next combat, our strat bomber is going to fly one, two, three, four, five into London, as well as both of our TAC bomber and fighter off this aircraft carrier in 110 will go into the United Kingdom. And that's it for combat movement on this side of the board. Everything else is non-combat. On to the other side of the board. Our combat will be in Korea. We're moving our four fighters and one tack bomber out of Korea into the Sea of Japan to attack that cruiser and two transports. And we're waiting to see if he will scramble his three fighters out of mainland Japan, if he wants to do that or not. Then... That is everything for combat phase. Yeah, for America. So, I'll get back to you and we'll roll these two combats once I figure out if they want to scramble in C-Zone 6 or not. Okay, so we're back. And, sorry, I got stuck in the middle of some stuff and then uh, Ben hit me back about the scramble. So he's going to scramble all three. I figured as much because then it'll actually be a battle. So we're going to start out. I have everything set up. I have the battle over just bombing London first. So we're going to have two fours and one three attacking London. Well, that's two hits right there. Just make it. Yeah, it's three hits. Nice. Spicy roll. All right. Now, he has a three and a four, the red is four, uh, coming back. D heavy damage, just one, just one. Yes, all right, just one, so one hit. So, everything, the, Itali or the Italian fighter and the German tank are dead in London, and then I will take... I will take my fighter as damage. All right, sweet. So these guys are going back over top of London. Then now I have this ready. So then we're going to have Japan 
with three fighters and a cruiser versus four fighters and a tack bomber. So, all right. So I've got four threes and one four. Blacks are threes. One, two, three, four. Sweet. Okay, four hits. Yeah, and you got four. All right, fuck you. Yeah, perfect. So, one, two, three, four. And you have basically the opposite going of three black fours and one red three. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> okay, so one hit. So I'll lose one fighter. Boom. All right, and then that's it for over top of Japan. All right, so for non-combat movement, the aircraft carrier is going to go... Yeah, one, two, down into 91. Attack bomber went one. Now it's going to go two, three, four. Land on the back of the aircraft carrier. Then this aircraft carrier from the eastern United States is going to come one, two, three, in. And these two fighters are going to go one, two, three, four, and land on here. One's going to land on there, and one's going to land here. Then our two destroyers, one, two, over from West Indies. Then our tr three transports are going to load up three infantry. Two artillery and one mech. Bring over one, two, three, and drop off we're gonna drop off two in Morocco and one in Gibraltar. So the two guys and two artillery will go there, and then the one guy and one mech infantry will go into Gibraltar. As well, actually, As well, these two fighters are actually going to land on uh, Gibraltar as well. Because they went... One, two, three, four, five coming from an airbase. And then this strat bomber came. Where do you go? One, two, three, four, five, land in Scotland six. And then We are going to take we're going to leave all that there. This guy is in the eastern United States. Yeah, we're going to leave that just like that is. And then 
Rest of the non-combat movement, we're going to move one man into uh, Algeria. And that's all of America's Eastern non-combat movement. So we'll come to the West Coast. Perfect. And two aircraft carriers down in Hawaii. Battleship down in Hawaii. Two cruisers and three destroyers as well as one submarine and two transports. Into Hawaii. And Actually, the transports are going to bring two anti-aircraft guns into Hawaii and drop them off. And that's turn. So placement, I am placing two fighters in the Western United States. And then, I'm placing, over here, I'm gonna place another three transports in 101, and three more infantry, as well as two tanks. and a destroyer. So, that is turn. And the United States gains 55 plus 15. So that puts us at 70 again. And for the unit recap, we have two AAA, in Eastern United States, three infantry, one mech, two tanks, and then a British artillery and British infantry, and 101, three transports, US, one transport UK, and then one US destroyer. In C Zone 91, we have two destroyers, two aircraft carriers, a tactical bomber, and three. Uh, transports. In Gibraltar, we have two infantry, a mech infantry, and two fighters. In Morocco, we have three infantry, two artillery, and a uh, tank. In Algeria, we have one infantry. In Tunisia, we have two infantry and a mechanized infantry. In Scotland, we have one strategic bomber. Sorry, I got interrupted again in the middle there for a second. So, uh, my, I forgot to say, my three fighters and one tack bomber from C-Zone 6 went back to Korea. And then for the final recap over here, I have a battleship, two aircraft carrier, two cruisers, three destroyers, one submarine, and two transports, and 26, as well as there's an Anzac cruiser. And then in Hawaii, I have three infantry, one mech infantry, and two AAA. In Western United States, I have two fighters and that's everything.